Mr. Speaker, I'd ask the clerk to please call House Committee Substitute Number One to House Bill 264. Mr. Clerk, please report. House Committee Substitute One to House Bill 264. Gentleman from Carter. Move adoption. Motion made for the adoption of House Committee Substitute One. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, all those in favor, please signify by saying aye. aye. All opposed, nay. Motion carries. House Committee Substitute One is adopted. Gentleman from Carter. <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, in court operations and administration, uh, this bill, as amended by the House Committee Substitute Number One, provides $9.8 million in general funds, $636,000 in restricted funds, and $52,000 in federal funds in fiscal year 25, and $15 million in the general fund, $979,000 in restricted funds, and $80,000 in federal funds in fiscal year 26 to support a 4% salary increase in fiscal year 25 and a 2% salary increase in fiscal year 26 for all personnel. It increases the general fund by $563,000 in fiscal year 25 and $528,000 in fiscal year 26 to support seven additional possess <coughs> positions. Under the local facilities fund, it increases the general fund by one and a half million in each fiscal year to support additional use allowance for courthouse projects authorized in Butler, Clinton, and Crittenden counties. It adds language requiring reports on asset pre preservation project pools authorized in the capital budget. Um, it also authorizes the construction of a new court facility in Owsley County with a project scope of 28 million in fiscal year 25 and it increases the general fund by 2.7 million in fiscal year 25 and 5.5 million in fiscal year 26 to support debt service for capital construction projects totaling 67.6 million. And finally, it removes language specifying the process of employee layoffs, furloughs, and reduced hours, amends language for salary increases for 4% in fiscal year 25 and 2% in fiscal year 26. And finally, it allows the bonding for a new Court of Appeals building. If there are no more questions, I move passage of House Bill 264 as amended by House Committee Substitute Number 1.